Hello guys, it's Bamdan UK, and today I'm going to bring you a tutorial on how to live stream on Twitch.tv. Lots of you have been asking this in my previous live stream. Today I'm bringing that straight to you. So first of all, you want to open up your internet browser. When it loads, type in Twitch TV. Go to the Twitch.tv and make an account. Now, once you've got an account, you're ready to go to XSplit. XSplit.com. Register an account here. XSplit is free, however you do benefit from buying a full license by getting a few extra features. So once you've actually registered, you can download XSplit. Now once you've installed XSplit, you want to go to wherever you save the shortcut and open it straight up. Now this does take a little while to open, and there we go. Right, log in with the credentials you signed up to XSplit with and you're ready to go. Now we have XSplit open and fully functional, we want to go over to Tools, General Settings, Channels, and now we want to go Add. Right now if Justin slash Twitch TV is not here for you, go to More, and the plug install will load. Now find Justin slash Twitch TV and click Install. Mine's already installed, therefore I do not need to install it again. Now click Add. Just in slash Twitch TV and log in with the credentials that you used to sign up at Twitch.tv. So I'm going to type in my credentials now. Right, I'm going to be put setting up settings for 720p video. Now, if you do not have a good enough internet to stream at a constant 2.5 megabyte upload speed, then you will not be able to stream at 720p. Now, I'm going to set the quality to 10 and the VB. The max bitrate is 2500, however, this can be moved up to 3000 or even higher. Now, all the audio encoding can stay the, part, stay the same. Now, you can click test bandwidth if you want to, however, I'm not going to cover that right now. Click OK, apply. Now, you may want to have a look at all the resolutions. Now, as I'm using 720p, I want to make sure that I have. 1280 uh, 1, times 720 720p HD TV video which is in 69 um, ratio right so that's fine there so I've got it ticked and um, you want to make sure you set up your microphone I'm using the editors keys SL300 to record my audio and um, you just click apply and OK now if you go up to view you want to change the resolution to what we just said that's done and the frame rate to 29.97. Note, you will be only able to stream at 25 frames per second unless you buy the premium version of XSplit. Now I have my transitions to fade, so therefore when I change between the scenes, it will fade in and out from the two scenes. So for example, I'm going to show you how to add a game by playing PC. If you want to see me uh, streaming from a HD PVR, then go ahead and ask that in the comments. So you go up to file, click game, and this will be your exe that's open. Now this is up here, and you may need to open up the game before it actually recognises that it's playing. So therefore it's open, and if you go back to XSplit it should be open, there you go. And XSplit can now see it. So now you want to maybe add the second scene to make it a little bit more personal. So for example when I go for a food break, I use this food uh, food little icon I made and uh, it just says be right back so basically this will fade in and out to each, each screen etc so that's absolutely fantastic how that all works together and it fades together you will need to buy a premium if you want to utilize all the settings and everything within expert as um, you, it's just a good thing to have if you're going to be streaming very often so to actually broadcast on Twitch TV, all you've got to do is click broadcast and then click broadcast Twitch TV and then that will take a little while to initiate the stream and then it will start streaming. To announce your stream onto Twitter and Facebook you can click announce and then click it and then obviously you can tweet it out and it does it all for you. Now thank you for watching this video, if you have enjoyed this video then uh, please let me know in the comments and give it a huge thumbs up. Thank you guys, I'm out.